Hey everyone, welcome back to my channel. My name is Emily and I talk a lot about Salesforce. Today I'm going to be showing you how to activate a forecast within Salesforce. So this is pretty easy. Um, you just got to know where you're going and it can be done. So let's go ahead and hop into setup. All right, and then we're going to go to forecast settings over here. And currently we have one inactive forecast. I am going to hit the down arrow and activate it. And boom, there we go. We have an active forecast that we can go back into the front end and go ahead and look at. You can have up to four activated forecasts at once. So if you wanted to have a revenue based forecast that shows you approximately how much you can expect in your pipeline currently as far as revenue, that is a possibility as well as if you want to know how much product you're going to be selling so then you can appropriately allocate for those resources. You can have a product-based forecast as well. I am planning on doing a crash course in all things forecasting so if you'd like to see that let me know in the comments down below um, of what you'd like to see within that and covered within those topics. It should be pretty comprehensive but with that being said thank you so much for joining me today. If you like the video be sure to give it a like, subscribe, you can check out the courses down below or on salesforceupskill.com. You can connect with me on LinkedIn and Twitter at Emily Call MBA. Thank you so much, and I'll catch you guys in the next one.